what's happening youtube i am highway to hell and uh, this is my bike yamaha yzf r3 so this is going to be an update on the roll on brass coated chain that i had uh, put earlier after my uh, oem chain uh, lasted uh, 30000 kilometers uh, i went with the roll on brass coated chain so the specification is uh, it's it's a 520 chain and it has 112 uh, links and it's a x ring chain so i got this chain when my odometer reading was at uh, 30000 km and right now i am at 47300 so i've used this chain for uh, 17000 km so far it's been positive and i'll tell you my experience and a uh, couple of uh, you know positive points which i really like about this chain and there is also a slight uh, concern with this chain which which i'll also speak about i i have already done a couple of videos on this chain about unboxing about first impressions about where to buy how much i paid and all of that and uh, i'll put the links in the description box um, you can go check it out if you are planning to Uh, you know if you are evaluating to buy this chain now i think uh, the number one thing that i'm really impressed with this chain is that the noise levels are very very low and and that's really impressive now obviously after 17000 kilometers yeah there is bit of wear and tear and now s- some noise has uh, crept in but uh, when the chain was new and for quite a long time the chain is not loud doesn't make much noise Uh, so that's a good thing it's also because of i think how it's how the machining is done how is cut how the tolerances are and also on the front sprocket you also have a rubber plastic kind of a molding and its main purpose is to keep the uh, noise down and that it does pretty well the second thing <clears throat> that i really uh, like about this chain is that so far i haven't had any kind of rusting on this chain and that's because it's brass coated obviously now you can't see i have you know put the chain loop so it's not visible now but i have had no rusting on the chain or on the sprocket which is great i have just i mean in chennai we have just had the monsoon season which is uh, around october november december and uh, throughout this whole monsoon season i haven't had rusting on my chain see i live in chennai and uh, it's a very hot and humid place a coastal city and uh, rusting can be a big big problem so if you are in a you know very hot and a humid place in a coastal city i think uh, you know a chain like this can uh, be really good because it has that that you know brass coating and even on the sprockets you have zinc coat coating so that Uh, you don't get rusting on your chain so so that's a good thing and also the third thing is that i don't you know feel any major power loss as soon as i open the throttle there is good pickup there is good acceleration so so far i don't feel that you know i am losing any power uh, at the rear wheel and the only one thing right now is which is a slight concern is that some of these x rings that you see over here for example you see this x ring is broken so this is one spot and there are two three other spots right now there i think there are three spots where this x ring is broken so that's a slight concern uh, and uh, i'll put up the pictures over here i took up some pictures earlier so i'll i'll put that up for uh, <clears throat> for your reference uh but i'm not sure why this is happening is it maybe maybe something that i am doing wrong i'm usually very very careful and uh, i pay a lot of attention to my chain uh you know as soon as i see that the you know chain is getting loose i adjust the slack i keep it looped and uh, cleaned most all the time uh so i'm not sure if maybe i am doing something wrong or is just that the quality of the these x ring is probably not up to the mark i would love to know from you guys if you have been using this chain uh let me know first of all how long have you used this chain for and have you are you seeing this similar problem that i am seeing 
not uh, any major panic right now but yeah just a slight concern and uh, yeah the last thing is uh, we have to see how long this is going to last i have done 17000 kilometers on this so it will definitely go 20 25 i think and after that i think we'll have to i'll have to just evaluate in shorter intervals and see how long this will last so i think uh, so far i'm 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 happy but only thing is this this x ring ripping out which is which is a slight concern because if this is broken then it can't hold the lube it will become dry there'll be more wear and tear there'll be power loss etc so so that's about it guys thank you so much for watching do let me know your views also on this chain if you have been using this and uh, that's about it i'll see you soon in the next video until then i am highway to hill and you ride safe ciao